Okay. Good evening. This, I'm David. And I'm Barbara. And, and this, this is, is One Take Old Movie Reviews. And, and we have a disclaimer. We are simply doing this for our own enjoyment okay. and entertainment. This and has no value. <laughs> no, we don't ever expect anybody to watch them, but we're having fun doing them. And this is our coronavirus entertainment. So we're stuck. We don't have any place to go. We can't go out to eat and enjoy each other at a nice restaurant. Anyway, so what's our movie tonight? Tonight we watched In Old California. It's a 1942 movie starring the Duke, John Wayne. Uh, also starred Benny Barnes, that's a female, and Albert Decker. And uh, it's a little story about uh, John Wayne was uh, a pharmacist. His character's name was Tom Craig, and he moved from Boston to Sacramento, California. And he gets into a um, conflict with the, uh, the, the man, the man in town who pretty much runs things. Yeah, and, he's uh, he's a thief and a bully. Yeah. And and uh, John uh, rents begins his own pharmacy. And rent space from uh, this man's uh, fiance, and that creates a lot of the conflict in the movie itself. Yeah, and she falls in love with him, but there's um, but she, okay. So I I think this movie is sort of a story of redemption because she is this dance hall girl who is the star of this. What would you call him? I want to call him a certain political party in America, but oh, yes. he's a bully, a greedy bully who takes things from people by force, um, burns burns them out, you know, uh, looks out for his own interests. But um, he it, he has um, basically bribed this woman into marrying him, and so she's going to take him for everything she can and she's the main singer at his bar his saloon anyway and so um, so the story continues and and it, it all ends uh, favorably as you might expect this is a black and white movie that it was very well I think it was well done there was no lack of interest in any of the um, any of the screenshots, I didn't think. I mean, they were all detailed and anyway. What I, what I, I, I'm not going to say what I liked about it. Um, that uh, what was I going to say? Oh, I'm sorry. I forgot what I was going to say. <laughs> okay, well, I liked that in the end. Of course, the the dance hall girl fell in love with John Wayne, and in the end. She was, she, she kind of changed roles in her life to be a, she, she, they had a, they had a, an epidemic of typhoid fever at the gold rush, at the gold camps, and she went up there to try to get money from the gold miners by entertainment and she ended up becoming their nurse because it was so bad and anyway in the end she's just um, you know a plain you know Western woman just um, she redeemed herself from and that's pretty much the way the story went yeah. uh, I did notice I, I checked John Wayne when this movie was shot he was 35 years old a little different to see him playing the role of a pharmacist. You don't usually think of uh, of the Duke, particularly in, in a body old town like they uh, portrayed uh, Sacramento as being at that time. Yeah. But he he would played the part of a pharmacist. Um, I did look up Benny Barnes, who was his the leading female. She had a 50 year career. She was an English actress, and she uh, actually starred in films from 1923 to 1973. Wow! And this was a 1942 film. And then Albert Decker, who played the um, his sidekick, the the one who was um, oh no the bad guy the bad guy oh yeah. oh 
his film uh, career lasted from 1937 to 1969. Wow. So that was the film. It was a it was an old film. Um, some of the scenes were a little bit uh, what we would call uh, kind of crude compared to today. Even the the guys who got shot and fell off uh, just kind of laid there and died and, mm -hmm. and not with the, the the professional moves that are part of, of film making today. We so. we have to say something about every John Wayne film that you know the intr the entrance his entrance. He oh, walks yes. into the bar. You, the first time you see him, he's walking into the saloon. He's wearing a top hat and a very elegant, uh, um, very elegant Eastern suit. And he's, of course, not afraid of anybody. And he bends a silver dollar with one one hand, you know. And you know, anyway, he's, he's and John Wayne, yes, John a Wayne commands a presence. Yes, he is the center focus when he is on the screen. He is in command, and yeah. you can tell. Yeah. And so that was the film. Um, now we come to that point where we give it our our Stolt Stars. Stolt Stars. Let's see what uh, my dear wife gave it today. I think for a black and white movie, it was good. It was very good, and I, I actually liked it better than the one that we gave three stars, whatever that was. Anyway, I, I give this one four stole stars because I, I thought that, the, I mean, the, 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 um, the whole thing was good and seeing John Wayne in a tuxedo and, you know, just all dressed up all the time instead of his vest with his double-breasted shirt, you know, whatever. But yeah, he, I thought it was very good. and. Anyway, and okay. he looked so handsome in this movie. I, I gave it three stars. I thought it was kind of an, an, an average film. It was good. John Wayne, of course, is the uh, the focus, and, and he carried the film. Yeah. But uh, it was an early film, and uh, I guess I'm getting too used to films from the late 50s. And uh, that's the way I saw it. Yeah. Okay, thanks. Thank you for watching.